Over the past week or so, I've been trying to mark the TVP T50 slash 51. Now, I am not a player who can just go and mark any tank that they want. I unfortunately suffer from the severe skill issue, as do a lot of players, once they get to around about 90%. I'll go up to 94, then down to 91, maybe even down to 88, and then back up to 94, and like to just hover my way around the 90% mark. But this video is going to be somewhat of a teaser for an upcoming video that I have planned regarding marking and the journey of marking tanks. That video will go through the ups and the downs of marking and show you hopefully the true to life kind of marking of a tank that I go through in hopefully an entertaining way. But this video today is going to be two games that I had this morning playing the TVP and I think that it just shows sometimes you need to take it into your own hands to really kick your team into gear and actually play the game. So you like these types of maps this is where it's like great to have optics, but I don't really want CVS as well. With this, you have kind of everything in one. Righty ho, let's uh, let's see if anybody picks this first of all, or if we can get anybody that's going to be uh, going up, not up the hill. We could have probably got one in, but it's not really worth that. The other play you can make on this map is going into the mid and sniping the person going up. Or clipping the person going up. But for this map, it's... Uh... Okay, not spotted. For this map, it's a little bit annoying with that one. Right, I think that's a full clipping. Because I think the last one went in as well. I mean, we'll soon find out once the... Uh... Yeah, look. So we get one extra in there as well. And if he keeps going forwards, then we can clip him again. Yudas is trying to do some stuff as well, but at the moment it's not worth... Uh... It's not worth trying to go for the Yudas. Where is this Escon going? He is climbing. I waited until he was behind the... Uh, like right behind the tree before firing, but I couldn't get a shot either way. Right, I'm going to go and switch to uh, to heat now. Especially for the S-Conk and the 430. The 430 can be pretty troll with uh, APCR. It's actually unbelievable that no one killed this 430s across the open though. Like from up here. Well, I mean, I guess it's our job now to spot him if he does do something dumb. I don't like how static these are though. I have a Fosh 155 and a Camp Panzer that could easily just go and kill this S-Conk for free. The only thing that hasn't been spotted is an FV, uh, G saw and Scorpion. But there's more than enough cover. Didn't go exactly how I wanted, but... Okay, 600, not bad. Guy's behind the rock, so we are not going to have a shot on him. We know where the FE is now, though. I'm a little bit curious about this TVP that was in the mid. Lost spotted in the mid. Okay. 
get him out of the game and then we go for the reload and we will just reload fully. There's the FE and that. So we know that the Scorpion is the only one that hasn't been spotted yet, which means that he's probably going to be at the very back. Right, that is where the Scorpion's probably going to be. The FE isn't even looking, but I cannot shoot the FE. Oh my god, I can't even shoot this guy apparently. Yeah, sure. I'm not still spotted, so I can just sit here and wait. I will not be able to do anything against him, though. Okay, I have to push this way and try and get out of the way of this. I have to go underneath this guy and get safe from over here. Because if I sit there, the TVP will kill me. I could try and go and kill this Gongivitsa, whatever his name is. However you say it. The problem is that he can one-shot me. I'd need him to low roll massively. I also cannot remember whether or not that is the top gun. Like what it looks like. Did he just fire? Okay. That's dealt with. Oh, well, we're not winning this. <sighs> I mean, marks go up, though. I think what we're going to initially do is just try and spot the cross up here. Or even just try and get some shots if this guy wants to spot it. Interesting. Nothing so far. I'm guessing everyone's gone around the outside, but... One blind clip into that. Someone usually wants to sit there. That 50B is already dead. Why is my mouse here? What? This is not the place for a mouse. Um. Interesting. We go back to here and then we just see what's going to happen because my team doesn't want to take map control apparently either. Let's start knocking some of these trees down. Also intuition the heat, so that then we can shoot the heavies if they decide to push as well. Especially if they decide to go up. Okay, free clip into the FE, lovely. Things you love to see. It's time to push back this way though, and try and spot these as they push down.
mean, we have good spotting on these. It's worth it. Okay, I'm down low enough now. It's worth it to get him out of the game. But I can't just keep sitting now. Ah, I mean, maybe I can go and push this side now and get the gorilla to shoot as well. We're still 3.5k down. My team is just so static. Team has also pushed all the way back, which is not good. Maybe I can like yoink myself up on this to get some spotting. And why is this such a struggle to get anything out of this game with this team? Really is good. If we can clear this guy out, it'll be amazing. Still the M60 to worry about though. And that T57. Although the T57 is not as much of a threat. Oh, come on. I mean, he doesn't spot me because I got stunned, but. You know, this is such a struggle to get anything out of this game. And yet I'm still only just breaking even on marks. I also only have three shells with heat left. enough to kill him though. And I will also go and kill this artillery now. I can kill the Jagdpanzer, he's gonna drop down, lovely. That means I then have free reign to go and kill this, uh, this little piggy. Come here. We love a bit of bacon. Instantly going for the reload though. Okay, that one missed. Now, they should be able to deal with that. But it may, we've made it look like we're going back to base. So hopefully we can now just go and kill the remainder of the artillery. I mean, if I have a shot on this, I'm taking it 100%. Okay. Well, he dies for that now. Wonderful. Now we go for the reload. We have two clips left. And hopefully we can do a lot of damage to the artillery. We still have the T-57 Heavy remaining, though. Which we need to be careful of. How have they not killed the uh, Yakpans yet? There we go.
don't have a clean shot. I've only got two shots remaining, remember. It's my spotting anyway. Oh my god, where are you going? Stop running! There we go. Nice! That was one of the worst teams I had, but... Okay. Nice, 6k damage.